The Marvelous Spatule Tale. Hi, everybody. My name is Leo. I am a junior ranger. And this is my puppy, Hero. Look, Hero. Dad lent me his Polaroid camera. Let me take a photo of you. Ready? One, two... Oh, what's that? A bee? No, it looks like a small bird. Look, it has two very long things attached to its tail. How interesting. Let's take a photo and send it to my sister, Katie. She is also a junior ranger. Smile, pretty bird. Katie, are you there? You won't believe what we found in the garden this time. Hi, Leo. Wow, that bird sure looks special. It also makes a buzzing sound. I thought it was a bee. How interesting. Let me see what I can find out about it. Great, I'm coming up. Hero, you stay here and watch our friend. I'll be right back. Come on, everybody. Let's go into the treehouse. Hi, Katie. So what did you find out about the bird? Hi, Leo. This special bird is called a marvelous spatule tail. A marvelous what? A marvelous spatule tail. See the two things on its tail? Those are long feathers that end in discs, or spatules. Only the male bird has those two long tails. Oh, I see. The marvelous spatule tail is a hummingbird. The buzzing sound you heard is the humming sound made by the fast movements of the wings. Normal birds flap their wings up and down. But hummingbirds turn their wings in circles. This allows them to hover in midair and fly left, right, up, down, backwards, and even upside down. Marvelous spatule tails are only found in the forest edges of northern Peru, a country in South America. Unfortunately, there aren't many of them left. That means we have to take this marvelous spatule tail home safely. Come and join us. Yeah, let's do that. See you downstairs. Come on, everybody. Join me in this party. One, two, here we go for lots of fun and lots to learn. Come on, everybody. Join me in this party. One, two, it's your turn for lots of fun. Ranger Rocky! Hello, Junior Rangers. Ah, I see you brought a marvelous spatule tail with you today. As you may know, the marvelous spatule tail is in danger of disappearing because their homes, the forests, are being cut down. To save this hummingbird, people have planted many trees and bushes in these parts to give the marvelous spatule tail a better home. That's why we're bringing it back here, Ranger Rocky. We found it dancing around a flower in our garden. Male marvelous spatule tails dance to attract females. They hop around on twigs and wave their long tails. Like other hummingbirds, the marvelous spatule tail flaps its wings up to 70 times per second. Hummingbirds use up a lot of energy from flapping their wings, so they need to drink a lot of nectar from flowers. The marvelous spatule tail likes the flowers from the red flowered lily plant, so you might want to look for those. Good luck, Junior Rangers! Thank you, Ranger Rocky! Let's see what we can find. Here is a grassy area with some plants and bushes. And on this side is a place with many trees, shrubs, and bushes that have bright flowers. Do you know where we should go? Over there, is a grassy area with some plants and bushes. And over there is a place with many plants that have colorful flowers. So where should we go? There, 
That's right. We need to go to the place with many flowers because marvelous spatula tails drink nectar from flowers. Let's go. Hey, Leo. The marvelous spatula tail is not moving at all. Oh, no. Is it okay? Hmm. When hummingbirds can't find food, they go into a deep sleep. They do that to save energy. They use a lot of energy for flying, so they always need nectar from flowers. So the marvelous spatula tail is hungry, but there are no flowers with nectar in this place. Now the bird will starve to death. <laughs> Water? Thanks, Hero, but that won't be enough for the bird. It needs nectar, which has a lot of sugar in it. I think I have an idea. In some places, People put feeders in their garden and fill it with homemade nectar, so the hummingbirds always have food, even when there are no flowers around. We can use this bottle to make a feeder. Great idea, Katie. But how do you make nectar? Hello, Junior Rangers. The easiest way to make nectar is to dissolve some sugar in water. We have water, but where can we get sugar from? Here. Have some of my sugar. Uh, thanks, Ranger Rocky. We can cut this bottle in half and use the bottom half to put the nectar in. Great idea, Katie. I'll take care of that. You've got to be careful with scissors. There. I'll leave the rest to you, Junior Rangers. Thank, Thank you, Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky. Here is some sugar. Stir the water to dissolve the sugar. Here, Birdie, have some nectar. I hope it tastes good. It's working, Leo. It's drinking the nectar. That's great. But what should we look for now? Hello, Junior Rangers. Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky. To find the marvelous Spatula Tail's home, just look for the red flowered lily, not for a spicy red chili or a goat acting silly but look for the red flowered lily. I see. So not for a spicy red chili or a goat acting silly, but, but look, look for, for the, the red, red flowered, flowered lily. lily. Thank you, Ranger Rocky. Okay, Hero, to find the marvelous Spatula Tail's home, you have to look for the red flowered lily. <laughs> Hero, there are a few dots on your radar. One of them might be the red-flowered lily. Are those red-flowered lilies? No, those are blue flowers. Let's move on. Those are red, but they are red fruit, not flowers. Better keep looking. Do you think that that is the red-flowered lily? I think it is. We found the marvelous Spatula Tail's home. Great job, Hero. We're coming over. Go get some nectar, marvelous Spatula Tail. Look, it's a female marvelous Spatula Tail. He is doing his dance again. We did it. We found the home of the marvelous Spatula Tail. Great job, everyone. Hooray! Yay! found a marvelous spatula tail in our garden. We learned that the marvelous spatula tail is a very special hummingbird and that its wings move really fast. So we took it back home where there are a lot of flowers to feed from. Good job, children. You did it. You are amazing wildlife rangers. Mission accomplished. Thank <laughs> you.